Hey guys, this is Alan at ERT, Electric Race Technologies, giving you live demonstration of the NXT display. So right here, this is quick setup because this is, you know, brand new display. Now we don't need to do this, well, I don't need to do this because I've already calibrated everything. So I'm just going to run through it right here. Setup complete. Here's the loading screen. Here's the main screen right here. So really simple. Got your battery bar indicator. Voltage. RPM. Now this is modular UI so you can change. RPM, amps, watts, whatever you want basically. Here you can toggle drive. Right here. Or not, I mean. Well, more on that later. Sport mode and eco mode switching. Miles per hour or kilometers. You know, a lot of tuning capability here. Here's your settings. It's got stats. BAC 2000, CYC X1 Pro, 72 volt nominal, firmware version 1.4 beta, motor stats, battery stats, various other stats, power adjustment right here. All kinds of adjustment motor settings you know, field weakening all that all that fun stuff but let's take this for a spin and see how it goes so here's the new main screen it's got a very nice rpm gauge See how it runs, shall we? The streets are kind of empty right now. I'm just gonna take it easy. I don't want to go too crazy. You know, I don't want this bike to break down on me. I'm actually really scared right now. Like, I don't know if this thing will break down on me or what. I'm quite scared right now. Now this motor is actually capable of revving to higher RPM, but I don't want to do that right now because, you know, it's been three months since I've ridden and I should really kind of go over the drivetrain before I do anything crazy. I haven't even, you know, applied a, like, grease to the chain yet. There's a motor idling right there. Alright, so we actually have different main screen options. 
we go to settings here display we've also got the new day night main screen so this is day mode here's night mode so you got different assist levels here zero being throttle only well we'll use zero because we only have throttle here we don't have pedal assist on this configuration anyways on this bike i mean here's speed mode torque mode motor idling as i will uh, give a demonstration right now let's see all right so we're in torque mode right now very responsive off the line Very good torque. Pop it into speed mode right now. A little too wide right there. Speed mode give us a greater, uh, better control, you know, on the road especially. Oscillation right there. You can definitely tune that. Popping a torque again. Braking right there. Alright. I'm going to stop here. we got to double check some settings. Power adjustment. So the speed limit should be off. There should be no speed limit right now. Let's turn that off. Let's go to motor. Let's turn down field weakening. It's actually set to 1%. Save that. Yeah, I've got a bit of a cold right now. <clears throat> Everything else looks about right. Let's take a look at our stats so far. Okay, so max voltage 82 volts, minimum 78 volts, 3.69 voltage sag, maximum watts, 2200, so not much, 28 battery amps, check the motor, 9000 RPM, 109 peak motor current, 19 degrees centigrade top speed no way it's 55 odometer trip meter everything looks right back into night mode since i'm doing a lot of urban riding i like to keep it in torque mode Chain definitely needs a bit of uh, <laughs> lubrication.
change back to the other main screen now. Notice that going to settings automatically disables the throttle. Any power, it's just, you know, safety reasons. Display. Next T gauge. Exit. Back to the previous loading screen there. Oh, by the way, we should be able to get our drive modes as well. Unless I screwed up the coating, which I probably did. Okay, let's show watts now. Yep, looks like it's working. Braking, turn in. Oh, it's not showing our, okay, there we go. Bit of a glitch right there. I'll fix that in the update. Look both ways. Yeah. Those of you watching at home, oh snap. This is uh, Al with the ERT, the NXT display, firmware 1.4 beta.